Because we trust in God's covenant faithfulness, we are free to make our confession before God and call upon His compassion. Let us therefore confess our sins so that we may be renewed in His grace. Let's now close our eyes and bow our heads in a moment of silent personal prayer. I'll conclude our time together by saying Amen. Let's pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The Gospel of Christ speaks to us of the pardon that we have through the finished work of our Savior Jesus. Here's the reading from John 6, verses 35 through 40. Then Jesus declared, I am the bread of life. Whoever comes to me will never go hungry, and whoever believes in me will never be thirsty. But as I told you, you have seen me and still do not believe. All those the Father gives me will come to me, and whoever comes to me I will never drive away. For I have come down from heaven not to do my will, but to do the will of him who sent me. And this is the will of him who sent me, that I shall lose none of all those he has given me, but raise them up at the last day. For my Father's will is that everyone who looks to the Son and believes in Him shall have eternal life, and I will raise them up at the last day. On the basis of the Gospel of Christ, we may be assured that our sins are forgiven for the sake of Christ, and we respond together by saying thanks be to God. Let's do it together. Thanks be to God. Amen.